Milos, um, you've had a very consistent year. Um, you know, five, five quarterfinals, uh, two semifinals. Are you pleased with, with your consistency or frustrated that it's not been transformed into titles? Um, there's a lot more positive than negative in that, that's for sure. There have been situations that I feel like I've been uh, necessarily a little bit more frustrated with results. But I feel like if you if you look at all of them, it's taken the best players in the world to to to, uh, to take me out of the events, and um, that's that's a good thing to have. And I, you have to put yourself in that position if you want to have a chance to win. Fortunately, I've been able to do so, and now it's about time to figure it out and make the most of those opportunities. That's great. And um, it's your first event since Wimbledon. Is that is that right? Yeah. I mean, you know, you, you had a great run there. You know, just just losing to to Roger. Um, is it an easy transition coming from the grass to hard courts? I mean, a surface we've uh, a surface we've had so much success in the past. It is. Um, it's the one surface out of especially the three that all I need to focus is on how to play well. I don't feel like I have to focus on adjusting my footwork, adjusting how I need to stand, where I need to stand. I, ha I feel like through instinct and uh, growing up on hard courts, I have sort of that more ingrained in myself, and it's easier for me coming onto the surface just to find those answers. And it has me very excited because I've had my best results up to date on the two surfaces that are my lesser favorites. And I'm really excited to get going on this hard court swing and to play these big tournaments because I feel like I can do much better. And here in Washington, I think it's your second time. You came, came last year. I mean, is there anything in particular you enjoy about this event and or, or playing in front of American crowds? Yeah, I enjoy this event. It, it's a... Uh, there's a lot of points up for grabs. There's a lot of importance to this event, but at the same time, it's an event that um, it allows me to train through the event. There's a great facility here with plenty of courts, a lot of practice time available, and also uh, train around matches so I can find my best tennis because being the first tournament since Wimbledon, I, I don't expect to play my best, but I expect that each match I get better and that will lead into me playing some of my best tennis into Toronto, Cincinnati, and the US Open. And we talked about your, your consistency, I mean, and you're up to a, a rankings high of, of six, is that correct? A world rankings high of six. Is there anything particular about your game that, that's seen that big improvement? If you could put it down to one key factor apart your, your overall game, what would that be, you think, that's, that's seen that? Attitude. I, I know how to win matches, and I know what I need to do specifically for my game uh, to win matches. I can't tell you what other guys need to do necessarily, but I've, I've found a lot of answers in myself. And that helps. And obviously, I just I feel improved tremendously on a physical, mental, and technical level. And just finally, just to sum up, you know, just uh, looking forward to this week and, and excited to be playing. I guess. Yeah, I am. This is a great week here in Washington. Uh, tough to play in the heat, but actually a great way to sort of start off the summer uh, of hard court tournaments and, and a great opportunity. And I want to do better than I have here in the past, and I really look forward to that.